So, um, if uh, Akhenaten tried to uh, expel, or he expelled Entropy, the god of Entropy, and the priesthood of Apep, something similar to that would be like, the argument that you can make for humanity it being that uh, it need to be saved or not and that being it is folly and hysterics hysterical episodes we try to outsource and into transhumanism and transhumanism the argument for doing it because oh my god it's human like these are all the things that um resonate hysterically hysterical like like a crisis scenario like crises instead like so it's very easy when for people to think they're not care because you're supposed to do this you're supposed to do that you're supposed to well we know um replenish the uh the population Exsourcing, I mean, outsourcing humanity just because of the fact that it's history and because you fell into a human state would be like, okay, birthing units and shit. Like, <clears throat> that takes the humanity away from, from uh, females, from feminine, right? Now, I'm not saying that I think this is going to happen. And you're, oh, you're one of those people that you're just like, yeah, well, maybe, but I mean, like, Do you know what you sacrifice in the present for entertaining fears of of uh, malcontent in the future? Is a dialogue, and you have charged up rhetoric now, and you don't have that dystopian future for for so it's for no reason. So it's for no reason because. You can't, ha you can't have, we can't have a, a chokehold on the future. It's not, it's not gonna, you're not gonna work. And you're already, we're already uh, have mortality, right? So that, that way it's, it's like, okay, don't play on our, our, our fear of dying because you're still human like unless you are immortal then don't hype me up about uh, we need to go and respond to this or that because they're dying because you're not going to stop the dying you're just going to send what resources that we have to every time there's somebody you could say is fighting for their freedom and then they can manufacture freedom fighters. They'll never stop manufacturing freedom fighters. And there'll probably be a, another stupid gas attack for counterintuitive reasons. And it will subside with an expl explanation because the person that they found to resonate the most with you buys the line as well. So then they just kind of mosey up next to you in the arena. So then they'll be like in the arena, like oh, I'm with, I'm with uh, Busey, I'm with, uh, I'm with this with with stupid or something like that, like sharing a little bit of the stupidity, because co-signing on it and that um, because if you can, you can argue with the aspect of reason that it has in your concern for it, for it. And like, when it's like getting all panic, panicky and shit, like, oh my God, man. you need a leader. But no, don't we all know, so we already know they're all corrupt and shit. Why do you need a leader? It's not like you're gonna do anything about it. I'm just saying we know that they're correct, so 
fucking leave one enough alone. I guess you just if I don't know how I already need a leader, then there's something wrong with me. What are you supposed to do? Oh, shit, like that? No, I'm supposed to do something. Yeah, you gotta do something about it. Why? Because if uh, good people do nothing but evil wins, why are you not sacrificing yourself? You know what I mean? <clears throat> We can't, I can't even sit, I can't even talk shit about Margaret Sanger, the transhumanist setting up uh, abortion clinics around. Why do they got to be in the black community if the white people are the ones that want the abortions? Like, why don't you have them in your neighborhood? It don't, never mind whether, who, who is in a situation that best fosters, uh, child rearing we we know that the hoods slums are not but see you could just telegraph your thinking you, you, like and it's not along the lines of solving the problem of an albatross in the community it is the albatross it is the albatross it's that thing it's that kind of thinking it says transhumanist So one one day, you know, Margaret Sanger will be like Mother Teresa. Why are you doing this for us? You know, setting up all these clinics and everything. It's because we love you. We thought we didn't matter. All you do matters. Your your black life matters. They do it. They're, they're fucking. They, they shot their shot. You shot your shot. I'm not. You know, we can't. You give our energy and oh they get it if you rationalize with it. You take it so you start to like argue on behalf of like, oh, they should be able to uh put criminally insane people in a in an old folks senior care facility. Like how this shit even happens that you hear about. You can never believe it. Never heard of anybody tell me that uh, a man can have a baby. So I never heard anybody, and I never had no reason to tell somebody who might have been molested or initiated into bisexuality at a slumber party that uh, a, a man plus a, only a man and a woman can have a baby. It seemed like as if that's what they think that they're trying to accomplish and they were misguided or something. <laughs> I see you trying to have a baby. Uh, let me give you a little bit of advice. Like, you should uh, see other people. <laughs> See, see other people. See, we should try to see other people. <laughs> I don't know why it's like this, and it's up. It's it's up to the government to take this off of us, because we already don't. Like we're being mocked. We're like this tough though. Are we really being mocked this tough? You know. Like, oh, but don't worry because uh, the the special skinheads as of battalion are kicking Putin's ass all over Ukraine. So don't worry. Like, okay, well, go uh, go Malcolm Nance. You could show him uh, fucking kill a, a, a Russian for for the, uh, for. The, oh no. Because uh, we can do it just as good as a whole white person. Everybody can want to compete with the white people, dude. The women. Everybody. <laughs> oh, my God. There's never supposed to be nothing anyway in sports and everything. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, we're going to keep, like, we got to keep, like, that's, the, that's how you know you're actually... Uh, alive because we just always dominate and, and except when it comes to a uh, shit that requires like tedious uh, follow-up discipline or something we could party in sports
Not that that's wrong. Not that that's bad. You know. You, like the Japanese try to like not party in sports and excel in academics as much as only as possible and fucking yeah. <clears throat> I don't think none of that's just ever gonna like it's just gonna go back to normal after okay, so after after whatever um taboos and regimen of uh propaganda it's just gonna go this is gonna go back to normal <clears throat> and uh it went in transhumanism once like the IMF, like whatever happens going forward, we hope it's involving the IMF. Like we hope that it involves the transhumanists too. <laughs> no, the lips get the bullet too. Like, oh, lips get the bullet too. Like that. Or right, does this make you happy? Are you happy? <laughs> Are you happy now? <laughs> <laughs> 